think we always know that the best way to find talent is to have a very diverse group of sources of talent that you can bring into your organization and reskill. And so, you know, several years ago, we started looking at all of the sources of hires that we had for the company and really found that we had some missed opportunities in order to get into our local communities, really find talent partners that could help us scale. And that was partners of all different um, sizes and shapes. That could be community partners, that could be nonprofits, that could be community colleges, that could be four-year universities and colleges. And so we really set out with some big lofty goals on how we could increase entry-level talent pipelines across our company. And we really started with very simple ways of thinking about it. What do we need to hire across our company? Where can we hire where we have a big concentration of jobs? Because a lot of times it will tell people is it's not about the first job you go into, it's about does the company afford you with a ton of opportunities so if that first job is not the right fit, you have a number of other jobs that you can take a look at and still be a part of that company culture. Or was that first job the perfect fit and now what we need to do is help skill and reskill and add on so that you can have this amazing career in technology with all sorts of aptitude across multi multiple platforms. And so I think where we've had the most success is trying new things. Um, we are lucky that we have a CIO and this entire ship team that are game for anything that we come at them with. Um, we've had an opportunity to go into about 10 different markets and focus on those markets. There's community partners in the market, the talent in the market has a lot of support from the top. And then really take a look at, do we have all the right jobs that people are looking for? I think the biggest thing we've learned, though, is that we have an opportunity to educate talent in a better and different way. We need to make sure that they know that the majority of the jobs at Bank of America actually don't require a four-year degree. So if people want to work while they're getting their degree or they want to take a look at a plethora of different opportunities, we're trying to get out there and host more education sessions so that you know, here's the opportunities we have, here's the different entry points where you can come in, and then here's all of the wraparound services that we have for you to make sure that you know what you're afforded once you come on board as an employee. And then, you know, not to underscore at all, the ability to be able to internally move across the organization as you grow and develop your skills. So I would say, I think it's a, a lot about creativity. We've been able to lean in and work with a number of large companies across the country and across the globe to really be able to share best practices, talk about what works, maybe what doesn't, and really be able to share in the spirit of trying to build more people that can do a, a ton of different jobs for us across the technology platform. So my, my goal is to make sure that we don't stop learning, that we don't stop trying new things, and that we learn from the talent that we're talking to about what they need and what they want in a technology career.